Now, lawmakers have agreed to hold a thorough investigation into last month's Sewell Ho ferry disaster. The 90-day probe will begin next Monday. Meanwhile, authorities have so far been unable to track down Yu byung -an, the practical owner of the sunken ferry, who remains on the run. But prosecutors have tracked down his assets, which total well in excess of $200 million and have been granted approval to freeze them. For the latest on the investigation, here's our Jim Young Gill. Korean prosecutors have been given approval to freeze more than 200 million US dollars worth of assets held by the owner family of the sunken Seoro ferry. Yu byung the head of Cheonghaejin Marine Company, which operated the ill-fated ferry, and his family are suspected of having accumulated at least $234 million worth of earnings through various crimes, both at home and abroad. A district court in Incheon on Thursday granted a request by the Incheon District Prosecutor's Office to freeze the assets of Yu and his three children, to prevent them from stashing away cash or real estate holdings before trials. Yu and his three children, Seomna, Daegyun and Hyukki, are wanted on a string of corruption charges and irregularities that are believed to have contributed to the sinking of the ferry. It is all part of an effort to hold the fugitive family criminally liable for the deadly April 16th disaster. Meanwhile, a French court has rejected a request by Yu byung -un's eldest daughter, Seomna, to be released on bail. The process for having her extradited to Korea began Wednesday, but could take up to a year. Jim Young-gil, Arirang News.